Finally, I'm going to show you the cupboard in the hall. Sometimes you can call it the cupboard under the stairs. It's in the, it's a cure, it's cheese shaped cupboard, uh, which is under the stairs of the, uh, leading to the flat above. Well, you can't see the stairs. Anyhow, this is uh, located halfway along this long corridor. And the front door is at the end there where the mirror is. So let's look and see what's inside. Oh, by the way, just to the left of it is the thermostat for controlling the central heating system. And I've got it set to 20 degrees now. It's on day and night. If the temperature drops below 20 degrees Celsius, that's 70 Fahrenheit, then the, the boiler kicks in and maintains it at that temperature. If the temperature is above that 20 degrees Celsius or 70 Fahrenheit, it doesn't turn on. So that's good. Uh, when I leave here, I'll probably lower it. I'll probably lower this to uh, down here. Maybe I shan't bother, I should so I'll just leave it over here. So when, when guests arrive, they won't have to mess around with that. It's set to a reasonable temperature for the flat at all times. And the time is uh, disabled effectively. Okay, back to our cupboard. Open our cupboard. Uh, turn the light on. The switch is round here. It says light, light switch. Okay, on the back of the door we've got a broom and a brush and pan. And this bag contains bags, empty bags. That bag contains instruction booklets for the flat, for various equipment in the flat, the Wi-Fi, uh, the fridge perhaps, washing machine. I think the uh, boiler is missing and the oven may be missing, I'm not sure. I'll check later. Okay, we've got some useful bits and pieces over here. Here's some hooks if you need to put any hooks up. And there's some spare bulbs, lamps for the ceiling. Uh, here's a torch and uh, some cable, I'm not sure. Oh, a lamp that's not in use at the moment. Uh, a manual lamp, hand wind one. Spare batteries for smoke alarms. And, uh, oh, there we've got some other bits and useful things. There's a pump here for a, an, an air bed. Now, looking in the rest of the cupboard, we have a vacuum cleaner, a um, mop and mop pail. Here we have a, a ladder to reach bulbs on the ceiling and we have a, a, a long handled brush and pan, an ironing board and also a, a clothes horse which comes out and st which is um, it's it can be stretched out and you can dry clothes on it if you wish. Uh, this is this bag here, a grey striped bag contains Lots of useful things which used to be in the desk in the front room, the desk no longer here, but lots of stuff in there. All sorts of, there's tools, uh, there's um, pens, there's pair of reading glasses, there's, um, uh, not sure about batteries, a sewing kit. There's masses and masses of things in there actually. It's a useful bag to, to consult if, you, if you're short. Maybe even adapt, adapters too. At the end there's some uh, materials for repairing things in the, and repainting. And I just want one thing of interest, uh, in that box in the corner, I think that's where the inflatable air mattress is, for which the pump is, is up here. I think I've covered everything. Oh, one or two spare hangers here, even a couple of umbrellas, or even a walking stick. I think that's it. Okay, I'll, I'll turn... Oh, oh, down here, an iron, electric iron. No, I think I have covered everything. <laughs> okay, that, that's the end. That's the end, I'll turn the light out.